Hi, I'm Sarah Levin, the Artful Inker. I'm an independent Stampin' Up! demonstrator. And yesterday, the Stampin' Up! catalog uh, was launched for the 2020-2021 catalog year. And I'm going to take some time and walk you through what's in the catalog, what the different icons mean, what you can... Um, uh, find in here in terms of samples and techniques, etc., and then tell you where you can go on my blog to find some uh, materials to coordinate and um, enhance your use of the catalog. So let me quit uh, talking about what we're going to do and let's get on to doing it. So uh, if you've got a catalog, grab it. If you don't, you can go to uh, my blog, theartfulinker.com, and click on the catalog tab and download the PDF. Um, you can also message me if you don't have a catalog and request a catalog, and we'll take care of that uh, afterwards. Um, if you have questions or comments as you go through, please go ahead and post them. And tag me in them, and I will come back to questions and comments after the live. As I said, I am um, live challenged. I can't read, talk, and present all at the same time. So for me, the the reading comments is the, the piece that has to uh, go by the wayside. So uh, this is the new Stampin' Up! annual catalog for 2020-21. Uh, it went live today and if I tell you there was a lot of excitement uh, around it, um, I might be downplaying it just a little bit. So uh, let's open it up and begin our walkthrough. So here at the very beginning of the catalog you've got to look at our new in colors Every year, Stampin' Up! introduces five new end colors that will be around for two years. And this year's end colors are Misty Moonlight, Bumblebee, Magenta Madness, Just Jade, and Cinnamon Cider. Now, this is a new list over on this side this year. This is all of our sweets for the year. And there are ten sweets. Um, and we'll talk about what's in a suite as we move through the catalog. And then there are two icons down here at the bottom that you'll want to be familiar with. One of them is the t blue um, starburst, and it indicates that it, there's a bundle involved. And when you purchase product with the bundle item number, you get 10% off. And so that means those items are on sale all year long if you use that bundle number. The other uh, icon is this red N, and anything that's marked with that red N is a new product. So as you go through your catalog and you see that, you don't have to wonder whether perhaps you have purchased it already because it is brand new. Then when we come through here, um, we talk about uh, some um, stamping techniques. Uh, there's two-step stamping, uh, how to use a marker on a stamp, stamping off, pattern building, masking, and heat embossing. They all have a page reference number so that you can learn these six techniques quite easily right here in the catalog. And then the other thing that we talk about right here at the beginning are cling stamps and photopolymer stamps. Cling stamps are the red rubber stamps, and photopolymer stamps are your clear stamps. You need acrylic blocks for both of those. Um, they both peel off and go back into the case that the stamps came in. And then we just have prettiness. I'm a huge flower fan. If you have paid, uh, have seen any of my creations, I'm going to say at least 75% of them involve flowers. And then here we have 
uh, the kits uh, that we have for the year. Some of these kits are all inclusive, which means that they, uh, like the Simply Citrus, it includes everything except a pair of scissors and glue if you choose to use it um, that you need to put the cards together. You get a block, you get a stamping spot, you get the stamp set, you get all of the card pieces and embellishments in this kit. Uh, same thing here with looking up. Now, if you would like um, an all-inclusive kit to arrive at your house every month, uh, then Paper Pumpkin is the choice. It comes with everything that you need to make uh, the cards and other projects uh, that come in the kit. So, all you have to, for this one, all you have to do is sign up for a subscription. You can buy one prepaid month or you can choose to um, subscribe and purchase this month to month until you no longer want to receive it. This is another one of uh, the all-inclusive kits. Uh, this kit seems to have everything except for the block. Um, and then down here we tell you what you will need in addition to what's in the kit. So it's a little more advanced than the first three kits. And then we take it up a couple of more notches over here with the Boho Indigo product medley. Now this uh, includes a pad of designer paper that is exclusive to the product medley. The stamp set is exclusive to the product medley. So are the dies. And then you also get ribbon and embellishments and some die cuts. Now what's new this year uh, this is the first time that we've offered a refill kit for product medley. So if you love all of the things that have gone with the stamps and dies that came in the product medley, the refill kit is fabulous because you can create more of the same because you'll get more of the paper. And let's make sure I don't tell you anything that you're not going to get in there. Um, some of the die cuts. So... Um, this, this is great. It, I, you know, this is probably one of my favorite designer papers in, uh, in the catalog. And I'm so happy. I just checked before I came live. My order has shipped today. And so it's Wednesday by Friday. I may have new product in the house. The flowers for every season is the first suite in the catalog. And this suite includes two bundles. Let me make sure you can see here. It's got two of these blue starbursts that indicate 10% off. Both of these stamp sets come with dies. Um, and then there's also a pad of designer paper in six boxes. There are memories and more cards, um, shaker domes, uh, ribbon and gems that are all part of the suite. So as you flip through the pages, if you like all of those products, then you can order them easily with the single item number rather than needing 10 item numbers to get everything. So this is the first of the bundles, flower, um, the jar of flowers. Comes The bundle comes with a, a neat jar, mason jar punch, and then there are some um, clear mason jar domes that fit through that punch that you can create uh, a 3D with a little shaker or a treat. That's one of the things that I'm working on is how to make a little um, treat package out of that so that you can open it up and not have to rip the whole creation apart. This is certainly one of my favorites so far, uh, the Celebrate Sunflowers uh, stamp set. Now, it also comes with a set of dies uh, that will cut out the, the flower and a gorgeous little overlay of the flower and then the stamp set. So when things are um, grayed out like this, it means there's a die that coordinates with it. And when they're kind of vanilla, like this one over here, it means there's a punch 
that goes with it. And then also coordinating with this are some embossing folders. We'll see more of that as we get back. So this bundle is a punch in a stamp set, and this is a set of dies in the stamp set. This uh, sentiment is fabulous and has carried over from uh, last year's catalog, as is to a wild rose. You can find um, several examples on my blog using uh, this stamp set. It was created by one of the Million Dollar Achievers, and it's also a distinctive stamp set. Uh, that's this little rich razzleberry starburst. And distinctive stamps have a uh, lot of photorealistic detail to them uh, when you stamp them. And it is a patented process that Stampin' Up! has developed. This is carried over from the previous catalog. It is also a distinctive stamp set. And then Mountain Air is a carryover stamp set from... Um, the mini catalog this spring. Now it's got two icons with it. One is the little green flower circle here and that means it's reversible. There are a handful of reversible stamps in the catalog which meant, means that they were designed to be stamped both on the detail side and the back side of the stamp so you get some lovely layering and fill effects. The other icon with this is that it is a bundle, so when you purchase the stamps and the dies, you receive that 10% discount. Painted poppies carried over from the spring mini, and it is also a bundle with um, the uh, painted labels dies. A new sentiment set. Uh, no, it's not new. There's no new icon here. Uh, this is Peaceful Moments. Nice font. A good general uh, set of sentiments. And then um, it is also a bundle with um, the Poppy Moments dies. Under my umbrella... Has, you'll notice it's this vanilla, which means that there's a punch, the Umbrella Builder punch that coordinates with it. Um, you may notice as we go through the catalog that some of my, the stamps have a blue highlighter. And I mark my cal catalog to remind me what I own. Um, it's been known to happen that I have purchased the same thing more than once because I liked it so much. So I now highlight my catalog to make sure that that does not happen. We have Timeless Tulips that carried over from the mini catalog. It is a distinctive stamp set. And um, there's the Tulip Builder Punch uh, that is bundled with it should you desire both pieces. Um, and if you are considering buying this stamp set, um, you should do that through me. And I have a tutorial, uh, like a, a class, strictly around the uh, Timeless Tulips bundle. Lovely You is a new stamp set, and it coordinates with this Lovely You um the lovely label pick a punch. It will make six different size tags. If you would like to see this punch in um, in motion, I have a video up on my blog today. Then we have dress to impress, which carried over from the mini catalog, and then. is World of Good, 
And again, down here we've got the seven pieces that are included in the suite. So if you like all seven pieces of the suite, you use the single item number. And then, of course, and the, the designer paper is stunning um, with all of the foiling on uh, one side of most of the pieces in the pack have foiling on them, and it's gorgeous paper. We have the Beautiful World stamp set, and it coordinates with the beautiful, uh, with the world map dies and it is a bundle and then here's this neat little suitcase here that's been made out of a paper pumpkin box that's a really cool to upcycle your monthly paper pumpkin box this uh, this way or we have many paper pumpkin boxes in the catalog this year and you could make a smaller version High Tide is just a lovely stamp set and, and fabulous as we move. Depth of detail. Game On is a new stamp set this year. I love all of the the shading in in this stamp set and think it will be to play with no pun intended since we're looking at games there geared up garage um, has carried over it's a great general set or for your car loving gal campology uh, for all of you campers, great for scrapbooking or cards. Rooted in Nature. This has been one of my favorites, and it's here again. Sailing Home. I, again, good. You love the beach, the outdoors. Uh, great for masking cards. Uh, so a distinctive set, so that almost photorealism in the stamping. And here's a picture of the new uh, mini stamp and cut and emboss machine. Now, while that is pictured in the catalog, it is not available for purchase yet. Um, uh, but I will let you know when uh, when it comes available. We have a good man that carried over and then loyal leaves leaves are always fabulous and these sentiments are ideas on color combinations whiskey business this is fun I have to tell you how hard I debated this set today as I was putting my order in. Being a dad is whiskey business. Your top shelf. You sending you an old-fashioned birthday card. Straight up, you're the best. I. Those are my kind of semi-punny sentiments. Good morning, Magnolia. Absolutely love this stamp set. I've uh, played this week and have a new video up using it. Uh, this is that the same stamp and cut and emboss machine open this time instead of folded up. The right triangles. These were on my order this morning. Uh, they coordinate with triangle dies and I cannot get my hands on them and play with them. The samples in the catalog are great, but I'm Really excited to have um, a new shape to play with. They are a bundle, so the 10% discount. Timeless Tropical has carried over. It is a distinctive stamp set. Seaside Notions, so we've got lots of beach themed, uh, or those of us who like warmer themed uh, stamp sets to work with. Uh, parcels and petals 
coordinates with a great perfect parcel box dies um, in the catalog. Today's tiles, these are really neat and I'm sure are going to find their way to my house at some point uh, during this catalog. Uh, they do coordinate with a set of dies. You can see all out pieces. And then um, you can use your these with your Stamparatus and do um, some hinge step. Uh, you've got these that will fill in, and of course using your Stamparatus with them will make that a snap. Um, new in the catalog this year, at least for a while, we haven't had them, we have a classic Stampin' Spots assortment, which is really great if you're not ready to commit to a whole set of full size the uh, color reference for your designer papers. So we have the stamp set dies and they are a 10% off bundle. Mini Mates, again just another uh, generally uh, all-round sentiment set and it coordinates with this fun die. And there are a couple of strip dies in that as well. I've already been playing with those. It is a 10% off bundle. The pretty parasols. They, you may remember the um, stamp set we saw earlier with uh, that coordinates with the Umbrella Builder Punch. Well, this one does too. You can see all of the uh, images that have the vanilla. Pretty greetings. This is a, one of my staples in the craft room. It has a sentiment for almost everything, and the size is really fabulous. Um, speaking of size, the size you see the stamps in the catalog are the size of the stamps. So then we move on to So Much Happy, and So Much Happy is a bundle with the happy dies. So there's a die that will cut out this happy and the balloons, and then you'll see this little banner uh, piece here as well. Well said. Um, I'm, I think of these almost like builder sentiments. There are lots of single words that you can mix and match with uh, other words to create your own sentiment easily. Uh, seaside View, another lovely beach theme set. Perfect if you like to do a little coloring. Our Stampin' Blends or watercolor pencils are fabulous for that. Aimed for You is another Million Dollar Achiever stamp set. And it is distinctive, which means that uh, the stamps will have lots of detail in quality. We have Basket of Blooms and it coordinates with this small bloom punch which you may have chosen during celebration as one of your free items. If you did not, it is now for sale in the catalog. We have Hippo Happiness which is making its way to my home. Um, I just think they're fun. The Hippo uh, sheep, unicorn,
Blossoms dies that creates just a really pretty overlay piece for those flowers. Here we have uh, monogram messages, which are kind of a cute uh, play with your, uh, you know, alphabet letters and um, words that coordinate with them. Over here, we're talking about uh, some pattern play, so mixing and matching some patterns. Um, they're very good about telling you what has been used in uh, the samples that are here. We have So Much Love, uh, which is on my probably list. I, I think these flowers are going to be gorgeous to color. Um, these go with the trio of tags dies that were in the holiday many and so they're a nice way to bring them into more uh, general everyday use. The zoo globe uh, coordinates with the snow globe scenes dies so it's a, a fun way to change that from winter holiday to just kind of fun. We have another color palette here. We have borders abound, which uh, designed by another of the million dollar achievers. Pretty font here, and and this nice little delicate outline stamp will be great for creating borders or backgrounds. And and here we've got a discussion. Um, step by step on how to create this blocked background that they've created on this card. Now we've got My Meadow here which is one of those sets that I call a stamp scape set. Uh, lots of fun pieces that you can create a, a, a landscape with. Um, you can go to my blog and put my meadow in the search bar and it will bring up some cards that I have created with that. We have a retreat that is from the holiday mini has this peaceful bath. Very a lot of Christmas stamps in the annual blog because we'll have loads of those that come out with the mini um, in August. We have Snowfront, another stampscape set and then here's the still scenes that go with the snow globe dies. We have nature's beauty here. Um, the animals in this are gorgeous. I have had fun uh, creating with them. Now here we're Itty Bitty Christmas. I love the Itty Bitty ones uh, because you get lots of nicely sized uh, sentiments. I don't use, um, don't always use a sentiment, so I appreciate a small one that I can tuck in. Um, here is the Tags, 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 uh, which is great for fall, Christmas, and Valentine's Day. And there is a die that will cut uh, this whole three, set of three images at one time. We have Snowman Season. There's a punch that coordinates, a builder punch for the snowman. And then another suite, Ornate Garden. This suite, two stamp sets with coordinating dies. 
Uh, there's the ornate floral 3D embossing folder, uh, a combo pack of ribbon, this specialty designer paper. Often the special, when designer paper is uh, mentioned as specialty, it means there's gold foiling on it, and then the gilded gems. So if you like all of the pieces, you can use the single item to order everything rather than entering all of the single items. And you will still get the bundle discs, bundles that are included. Ornate thanks. These just look like lovely handwritten sentiments to me. And they coordinate with the Ornate Borders dies and are a bundled product and then we have ornate style here with these lovely florals and they coordinate with the ornate layers dies which are just pretty layers to use with most everything. Forever Blossoms is a distinctive stamp set with some nice sentiments and there another distinctive stamp set here in Healing Hugs this rose is really outstanding stamped. Uh, dandelion Wishes. I'm a big fan of dandelions or puff balls. This is just lovely. Round of Applause. So you've got uh, Need to Send Congratulatory Notes. This might be the one for you. And then we have just a two-color color palette down here. So sentimental, lovely range of sentiments in really nice fonts, and with the Stitch So Sweetly dies, I have a chart for the dies on my blog, and it, we have another um, that you can download, and we have another color palette here. Now, the So Sentimental and Stitch So Sweetly are bundled. So when you purchase those, you get the 10% discount. We have Heartfelt, and there's a coordinating um, punch pack. So you get a plain heart and a scalloped heart. And you can see that cuts these three heart images. We have Heart to Heart here uh, with the florals and some hearts. And then Beauty Abounds, A Little Lace, and the A Little Lace coordinates with this detailed stitched lace background, which makes a lovely background on uh, pieces. Massive Thank You is coming to my house. Um, I, I just love the, I like Thank You, but I also like um, a, a little more with it um, and I like these because they aren't super mushy uh, I'm not a mushy kind of gal uh, we have butterfly gala here which coordinates with the butterfly duet punch so each of these pairs of butterflies stamps at the same time and then that image will uh, dual image will fit perfectly into the punch to punch them both out at the same time. We have See the Good here with some rosemary and an artichoke and a pear. And this is a distinctive stamp set. Great splatter uh, in this set. Everybody needs splatter, a splatter set. We have Last a Lifetime here with some pretty images, beautiful for uh, for and then an invitation here so if you want to create your own and another lovely color palette up here posted for you is part of a bundle with the rectangular rectangular postage uh, stamp punch and you'll see it's got a little scalloped edge to it and that's a 10% off when you purchase that bundle the peony garden suite which was a must-have for me. Peonies are one of my favorite stamp flowers. Uh, this comes with a bundle, uh, the square vellum doilies, 
the Peony Garden Designer Paper, which is just a really lovely, subtle uh, color palette. The Elegant Faceted Gems, Dainty Diamonds, and the Gray Granite Shimmer Ribbon. I cannot wait to see that in person. Uh, this is it here in the, the Gray Granite Shimmer Ribbon, and these are the Elegant Faceted Gems, and I don't think from here to you that you can see this uh, Dainty Diamonds embossing. Here's the stamp set. It's distinctive, and then there are dies that go with it for that bundle discount. Free as a Bird, uh, returned from last year's catalog. It was a huge hit last year. It is just lovely to color. And here is another color palette suggestion for you. And I love these. These, The way they've done these on the old journals or cards makes me think of uh, the nature journals that my uh, daughter used to keep when she was young. We have Beautiful Moments, which was designed by um, one of our demonstrators in New Zealand, who's a million dollar achiever. Grace's Garden, and as you can see, there are coordinating dies. Positive Thoughts, lots of nice little elements, just to back up your center and some coordinating dies. And the how-to here is talking about doing a little easy water coloring. Here are some great background texture stamps in this Comfort and Hope. We have Country Home, which is, I love this little kind of builder set. You fill your milk can or uh, the pitcher here, Harvest Hellos uh, with their apple and pumpkin or create a jack-o'-lantern and coordinates with the apple, apple Builder Punch. Great for back to school and your fall crafts, though I'm sure you could figure out something to do with it at season. Ridiculously Awesome. Also designed by one of our Million Dollar Achievers. Just some nice sentiments. I also, I told you before, I like small sentiments. I also like big sentiments so that you can do just a small amount of something on a card and put the sentiment on and you are good to go. Um, nothing's better than we've got chocolate and cookies and coffee and cocktails will be just fun to create with. And there's a coordinating set of dies. Back on your feet. These are fun, get well, hope things get better kind of stamps. Um, special Someone is returning from the mini this spring. And it is a two-step stamp, meaning that you have this fill image and then the detail image that goes with it. And they are photopolymer, so it's really easy to line them up and stamp both pieces. And there are a coordinating set of dies. And then we have these new fun uh, animals to create with from all of us. Our next suite is Whale of a Time, and there are seven pieces in this suite uh, with a bundle. Uh, we have this beautiful designer paper. The stamp set and coordinating uh, punch that cuts out the whale and a couple of other pieces. Uh, a grand kid, so uh, great for grandparents, but then there are also some good, you could use these uh, for just good general kid cards. And then we have Dino Days and their coordinating dies to go with them. Wildly, the animals in this are just sweet. Moving along, if you've got uh, a little somebody who likes... Uh, Trains, helicopters, and automobiles. Playing with patterns is our next suite. 
and there are seven pieces in this suite. We've got this ribbon combo pack, um, the alphabet dies, gorgeous paper here, and I'm not seeing a picture of the. Um, okay. Uh, we also have pumpkin boxes that I talked about earlier on. And then here's this pattern play stamp set that coordinates with those alphabet dies. Again, lots of great texture for backgrounds, and they've done a lovely job of showing us some ideas of how to use them. Happiest of birthdays. Again, this is another good big sentiment set that you don't have to do. You can, but you don't have to do a lot on the card These will probably make it to my house. We have Hooray to You, an easy birthday card making stamp set. Way to Goat. I love these guys and they will be here soon. We have the family party, so lots of family names. Great for cards, for scrapbooking. So, years for your scrapbooking. Uh, ages for birthday cards, um, anniversaries, you name it. We have senior years, uh, a cute little retirement set, another of Itty Bitties. This time it's Itty Bitty Birthdays. So lots of nice small sentiments for celebrating birthdays. Our next suite is Forever Greenery. And there are six pieces in this suite. So we've got the designer paper. We've got these gold hoops. There's gold laser cut uh, paper. We have a combo pack of ribbon. so that you get that 10% discount. Landscaping set. Uh, this time it looks like we're set at the beach. Uh, and I'm sure it would play nicely with the other stampscaping sets that we have. And then we have a brief discussion here on how to uh, create this rolled or blended background. If you need more information, I do have a video on my YouTube channel to show you how to make a blended background. We have Band Together, which has coordinating dies. You can see the pieces here that can be die cut. By the Dock, both of these are for coloring. By the Dock also has coordinating dies. We have Embrace Each Moment. I Again, another good line art set for coloring. And here they're introducing you to our line of stamp and blends. They are, hands down, my favorite coloring tool. Airy Versailles is a distinctive stamp set, and it is just lovely. All the uh, different layering um I'm going to call it collage style stamping that you can do with this. Uh, and on the page with it is a list of all the other distinctive stamp sets in the catalog. Beautiful Friendship is just a, a gorgeous floral stamp set in the distinctive style. If you check uh, my blog, you'll find several cards using this set with um, giving you some different ideas on how to use it. Uh, Bloom and Grow has a coordinating set of dies and again I've got um, examples on my blog to show you uh, some ideas how you can get started with this set.
always nice to know what's been used in the catalog. We have Field of Flowers here, which is another bundle with uh, coordinating dies. And speaking of samples in the catalog, um, that is one of the other things that the catalog is great for, and that's giving ideas. And uh, when you're not sure what to do, flip the catalog open and do what we demos call casing, which is to copy and selectively edit um, the image that is there. So, you know, use the stamp set shown or the basic idea shown and create your card. We have Floral Essence here, which carried over and coordinates with a punch. Um, the Perennial Flower Punch, this makes a gorgeous 3D flower. We have Inspired Airing Iris, lots of lovely texture, and this is a two-step stamp set. So we've got this outline and then the fill image for different pieces. Woven heirlooms, we've got lovely sentiments and then some good texture pieces here. Birds and Branches is a new set. There's a coordinating set of uh, dies so that you get the bundle discount. We have All Things Fabulous, which is another one of those, uh, it's a two-step stamp, uh, and then there are coordinating dies for your 10% discount, and then you uh, as they've done here. So, and then we've got a quick discussion in the sidebar on how to use their two-step stamping. We have another uh, suite here in good taste and this is a smaller suite with the bundle and then three other items. So we've got this gorgeous sure there are lots more things that we can think of to do with this. A friend like you, um, light texture elements that look like the beach and some good sentiments here. Uh, garden for some great coloring. Um, waterfront, another one of those stamp scaping sets. This is the one that started it all. I there fun. I have some samples for this on my blog, and then this is another one of those great splatter dies, a uh, dies, stamps. Artistry in Bloom, 
Foods, I think is the last suite in the catalog. And there are pieces in this suite with this bold design, um, these pretty uh, uh, sequins here. Um, I'm not seeing the rainbow glimmer paper off the top here, but it is part of uh, the suite. Then we have the hand-drawn blooms uh, stamp set with the sentiments, and then there's a coordinating die for that 10% discount. There are so many bundles in the catalog this year, um, which is fabulous because, as I said, uh, bundles mean things are on sale all year long. We have Best Year, which has some nice fonts and sentiments for all year round. And it coordinates with this um, Best Plaid Builder uh, set of dies for that 10% discount. We have a Walk in the Woods with some fun little sketched uh, toadstools, mushrooms, and maybe a porcupine here. We'll see what people create out of him. Uh, field journal uh, with a little more filled in sketching. Queen Anne's lace, which is a two-step stamp, as you can see here. Textured essentials for some great backgrounds. Silhouette scenes. Um, these are just easy to put on uh, a lightly colored background and add your sentiment and you've got a really great card. Palette thoughts. So we've got some backgrounds, a good sentiment banner here, um, a couple of sentiments, and then some neat texture. I really like these little screw or rivet type pieces here. And another color palette. Then we have our background stamps. Uh, we have three new background stamps this year. Uh, the Dry Brush, Camouflage, and Stack Stone. Now these stamps are not shown as dies. Um, they are almost, but not quite, the size of uh, space that these six take up. So they will easily, as you see here, cover a whole card background. Make a Difference great alphabet set because you've got both the uh, script and print alphabets and you have the angel stamp here to use if you are uh, selling your stamping up creations and an easy way to put in if you've got uh, a website to add that information there. And now we're on to the, the fun color. So these are all of the color collections. We have the four color families, the brights, neutrals, subtle, and the basics are your basic black, very vanilla, whisper white. <clears throat> and then our two sets of in colors. Um, this year we've listed the stamp and blends down at the bottom of each one of these columns. So we've added a new stamp and blend in the core colors in Melon Mambo. And then the other new stamp and blends are in the uh, newest set of in colors. You can buy your cardstock in color assortments in both the 8.5 by 11 and the 12 by 12. We have designer paper in 6 by 6 packs for each of the color families and for the end colors. Uh, we have um, ink pad bundles. So when you buy a whole family of colors, you get that 10% discount as you do when you buy the refills for those color families. We have our stamp and write markers. You can buy them by family here or in color, or you can buy the whole set of many marvelous markers, which will include all four color families and uh, the basic black. 
we have two watercolor assortment pencil assortments that are uh, stamping up colors in those assortments and then we've got some great modular storage pieces for your markers your stamp and write markers your stamp and blends uh, they've used them for ink refills your ribbon will stand up in here and of course your ink pads over here we have the fun tools of our embossing powder and the heat tool our versamark and its refill we've got masks or stencils um, our palette knives and then our uh, shimmery white and white embossing paste we have the shimmery crystal effects two colors the frost white and champagne mist in the shimmer paint we have Wink of Stella, which is just a lovely light brush of shimmer on things. We have Stays On in and a fine tip brush. We have our Memento ink and it works beautifully with our Stampin' Blends markers. Stampin' Spritzers, so many techniques that you can do with those. And then our blender pens which are great for easy control when coloring with our Stampin' Write markers and our watercolor uh, pencils. Stampin' sponges for using for techniques. We've got the Stampin' uh, chalk marker if you'd like to add uh, some little white detail to your projects. Sponge daubers, another one of the must-haves in my book. Uh, decide to purchase five full side ink pads. We have a which is great for creating backgrounds. We have the white uh, craft ink, which um, is good for embossing and also uh, use in techniques. And here is that set of classic uh, stamping spots that I talked about earlier. You get eight colors in that assortment. And then we have the uh, black stamp and write marker. The, and then we have all of the beautiful designer paper uh, that comes in. Uh, this is a 12 by 12, the artistry blooms, uh, six by six in flowers for every season. Forever greenery is a 12 by 12. In Good Taste is a 12 by 12. The Ornate Garden Specialty paper, you'll remember the specialty often has the foiling as it does in this case. Uh, packaging basics, uh, foil and whisper white pizza boxes. We've got a little mini shipping boxes. These are new. The mini pumpkin boxes, uh, printed gusseted cellophane bags, great for little treats or gift packaging. Um, a slightly larger, wider cellophane bag. Then we've got acetate card boxes. 
are clear tiny treat boxes and then a new acetate card boxes that will hold those little three by threes and I'm thinking they will be perfect for um, Ghirardelli squares and other little candies. Here is that laser cut uh, gold specialty paper that I talked about as we went through. Um, and then our basics in paper are our shimmery white, very vanilla, and whisper white cardstock. And then your thick whisper white and very vanilla. Uh, great for your card bases. And our 12 by 12 in whisper white and very vanilla. Good for some of your 3D projects and, of course, for scrapbooking. Window sheets, if you're making shaker cards or fun elements or even some 3D projects. Uh, we do have envelopes uh, in Very Vanilla, Whisper White and Clear. I have to tell you, I love the finish on our envelopes. It, they are so, the weight of them is good and they are just smooth and lovely. Uh, the Color Velveteen Paper Pack has me intrigued. Uh, it says that it's uh, a soft flocked paper. And then our foil sheets. To those, we've added a brass foil sheet this year. Fluid 100 watercolor paper. This is great for uh, playing with watercolor backgrounds. Our vellum cardstock. Lovely layers with this. These are new, these square vellum doilies. We have um, our note cards and envelopes. I love these for particularly for simple stamping cards, just quick and easy. The size is a little bit smaller than a standard card, and so it's easy to put a design on there and be done very quickly and yet satisfied with what you're designing. Uh, three by three slopes to go with the same size little note cards that you make. And here is that rainbow glimmer paper. Memories and more. So the mem we've got two sets of cards this year, the Flowers for Every Season and World of Good that come in uh, packs. 50 total cards. They are great for pocket scrapbooking. They are also great for making cards. Um, the Flowers for Every Season does have a set of specially colored envelopes. You uh, cards and envelopes if you prefer. Uh, we've also got sizes to coordinate with the card Whisper White. And then we've got our 6x8 scrapbook, and then the pocket pages uh, that the cards will fit in. Lots of embellishments. The frosted and epoxy dots have returned, as have the pearl basic jewels and the rhinestones. These hoops are new and are going to be such fun playing around with. Beautiful on ribbon. We've got these playing with pattern resin dots. I love that sizes. We have the elegant faceted gems. I love their translucent look with their colors and then these gilded gems. 
more embellishments here. These are the Flowers for Every Season gems. They're a great little um, different kind of shaker bit than your sequins. And I'm going to see what else I can do with those. I think they're fun. We've got these in good taste wood elements. ended um, stylus. I use this a lot for both scoring and when I make my 3D flowers. My favorite pair of paper snips, uh, a bone folder, and then um, we have the foam pad and um, die brush attached to go with the take your pick tool for helping to clear out the little I'm going to call them chads from uh, from these uh, finely detailed dyes. Lots of uh, ish this year are uh, lots of combo packs of ribbon. We have our in colors. Uh, this beautiful gathered ribbon in Rococo Rose is returning. This is just a gorgeous sheer ribbon in Pool Party. We have a, a baker's twine here and a, a stitched ribbon. This sheer black sparkle ribbon in organdy um, is returning as is the polka dot tool. Uh, is just a, a gorgeous color combo. Um, Daffodil Delight in a lightly ruched ribbon and Forever Greenery. The vanilla ribbon is really soft and a lovely loose weave and that braided gold trim is literally just to die for. The faux suede trim. It's been a while since we've had a um, uh, a, a brown ribbon, at least that I can think of. Uh, we've got the Playing With Patterns combo pack here uh, with three different width ribbons. Uh, this stitched double-sided satin ribbon in real red. And we finish with a gingham ribbon in bumblebee. 
We have several new adhesives here. So we've, we've got adhesive sh uh, sheets that are new. We've got uh, Stamp and Seal, which is replacing Snail, and Stamp and Seal Plus, which is a heavier duty um, adhesive. Uh, that's what's in these two rollers here. Uh, the Plus is for making your 3D uh, projects. Don't forget your silicone craft sheet if you don't have one of those. Those are great for techniques and some of your stickier things that you're going to want to do. The black stamp and returned. We've got uh, foam adhesive sheets, so whole sheets of foam adhesive, and then clean adhesive if you're wanting to um, un your things that were on wood blocks or if you have things that have never been mounted. Um, you could even consider uh, putting cling on your photopolymer stamps, though um, that's not really necessary. Our range of um, acrylic blocks here, you can buy them separately or as a bundle and receive a 10% discount. We've got the cleaner and the cleaning pad for your stamps, the stays on cleaner, and then your Simply Chamois for your quick cleanups. Uh, while you're working before you do the final cleanup at the end. Um, the storage caddy that will hold a full set of blocks. Lid paper. This is great for uh, your everyday stamping, lining up your projects. You've got something to stamp off on. Um, I use this. If you, you'll see it in my videos. We've got stamp cases the the full wide case and then the slimmer case um, that your stamps come in. We have a carrying caddy for your stamp apparatus and of course the stamp apparatus. Fabulous stamp positioning tool. Um, it is great for uh, lining things up, uh, stamping if you think you're going to have to ink again, put it on your stamp apparatus you've got the opportunity to add more ink and then stamp again right in the same place. It comes with the magnets and the plates and this foam pad. You can purchase an extra foam pad, um, a, a grid paper that fits just the Stamparatus size, and then there's this deluxe, deluxe foam pad with the grid on it. And then we start into a all of the punches. Punches are at full size in the catalog, so if you're wondering if something will fit, this is the size that they're going to be. So our circles, the butterfly duets, balloons, this small bloom, and then this This is a single punch that punches the corner, um, this little detail, and a slot. We've got labels. This little punch will punch your tag, a, a hole, and a slot. More tags. Tag toppers here. A couple of sizes of daisies. Sprig punch. Great fill piece for your cards. The pine tree coordinates with uh, one of the stamp sets in the holiday section. Our cat and dog and this perennial flower, as I mentioned earlier, makes a great little 3D flower. Our snowman builder and umbrella builder punches, the alpha, uh, apple builder punch, and our vases builder. Punches. So this is two punches, and you get one with a solid outline, and then one with the scallop outline. We have whale um, builder, another, 
and then this lovely uh, labels pick a punch that you can punch in six different uh, sizes. Uh, well, two different styles, three uh, sizes in each style. These are the new stamp and cut and emboss machines. We have a mini and a full size. They will be out later in the catalog year. So they and then the products you keepsake box is a keeper. The ornate frames are beautiful. You don't need a particular stamp set to be able to use those. Uh, the perfect parcel box that I mentioned earlier. Um, this is the stitched lace background and then we start we have our stitch nested labels, the stitched rectangles, stitch shapes. This is the trio of tags, die, lots of words here. This coordinates with the tool uh, wild rose. And then we have our embossing folders. And these come in two styles. We have our regular embossing folders, which are in this, um, I'm going to say mint macaron shade. And then we have our 3D um, embossing folders. I'm making sure that I'm looking at that correctly. That I am not looking at that correctly. So the mint macaron are folders. We have three sets of mini embossing folders. So there are two different styles in each of those sets. And then we have um and and they are when I say just embossing folders, they don't have quite as much detail as the 3D embossing folders have. And then back here we have our host sets that you can only purchase if you've hosted a party or reached at least $150 in product purchase. And then we have our chart here for Stampin' Rewards. And during the month of June, you Purchase $250 in product or, or you host a party, whether it's in person, online, or with a catalog, uh, for $250 or more, you will get a bonus $25 in product. So you'll get the normal uh, host rewards that you would get in this chart plus $25 more. And when your purchase or your party reaches $450, or more, you can choose a 50% off item. And then just $99, and your shipping is free. Uh, plus, during the month of June, you get to pick a bundle of your choice as an extra gift when you join my team. And then finally at the back we have an index for all of the accessories. So I hope that you will hop on over to my blog, theartfullinker.com, and check out today's blog post. I have catalog tabs uh, for you that you can download and they coordinate with the different color-coded sections that you can see in the catalog. I have a chart for you that you can download with the designer paper and the coordinating colors. Um, there's an adhesive chart for you to download. I'm trying to think what else. There were so many in, 
in today's post. You should really go check it out. While you're there, if you haven't signed up for my newsletter, you should click and um, I do send out tutorials, 